Hi guys! Okay, so today's video is going to be a back to school related video. Yes, it is that time of the year. I think it's like around two or so weeks, at least here in California, where people are going to go back to school, which I know kind of sucks because that means summer is ending, your fun and everything is over with, and you have to, you know, go back to school, study, and that's not always fun. Um, but yeah, so basically in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys makeup essentials for going back to school. Um, first, I will start off with a makeup bag essentials products that are really convenient to just throw in your makeup bag and then also I'll be showing you guys products you can either just um, throw in your school bag or place in your locker and those are the products that will kind of get you through the school days so let's just get right into this video and also um, I will be uh, posting the link to my get ready with me back to school related video down below in the description box so if you guys are interested definitely go and check it out and that video I use all drugs or products so that is pretty cool so yeah let me just stop rambling and let's just get started so like I said I'm gonna start off with the makeup bag essentials first so the first thing are blotting sheets you definitely need these especially if you do have really really oily skin these will be your best friend every single day that you guys are in school these are the Jean-Pierre cosmetics oil uh, oil absorbing facial tissues they come with 50 sheets I got these in my beauty box 5 and these are really good also the hard candy ones are good I have them but I have no idea where they went but those are cool because those are like different color stuff and those are just really fun and they work just as well as these do and you just take a bad boy out and just you know blot your face with it and it just controls the oil so definitely need oil absorbing sheets another thing to control the oil is um, powder just you know pack your favorite powder in your makeup bag this is the covergirl clean oil control pressed powder um, I absolutely love this powder it's one of my favorites right now and um, yeah it just keeps your skin looking matte the whole entire day and then also um, pack a kabuki brush or a powder brush just this is just the elf kabuki brush so yeah really need like a powder or or oil absorbing sheets or you can just pack both um, now next is another face product and it is a concealer you want to maybe pack like a full coverage kind of concealer just in case you know you have um, any reddish peeping redness peeping out through the day or like maybe um, you know a pimple coming in and you just kind of want to cover the redness and not make it so noticeable so this is like a really nice heavy-duty kind of concealer this is the Sonia Kashuk all covered up concealer and I like it because because it's fairly tiny so you can just throw it in your makeup bag it's not going to take up too much space and this is what it looks like and it's really really creamy it's super pigmented and I love this for my blemishes it tones down the redness and it hides your pimples amazingly so really need like a heavy duty concealer um, next are eye products so um, packed two eyeliners you can have you know one neutral eyeliner and then also one a little bit more bolder like a black eyeliner this is the Rimmel London Scandal Eyes waterproof um, eyeliner these are really really nice they stay on your waterline through the whole entire day and it's a more natural kind of look um, this is the covergirl ink it eyeliner this is in black um, they both are really nice this also stays on your waterline and it's really really creamy and it doesn't budge at all so just to pack you know eyeliners just in case if you're not if you if you were like in a hurry you know you didn't put eyeliner on you can just have these babies or if you just want to touch up through the day or whatever so eyeliners also the last eye product is a mascara um, just pack your favorite mascara I'm the type that I use like five different mascaras on my eyes lately I've used two which is pretty good um, but you just need one so this I just chose the Maybelline the Fossies Big Eye Mascara why I chose this is because it comes with a lower lash wand and then also um, upper lash wand so you can touch up both of your lashes um, and this is a really good mascara as well and I filmed a review on it and I'll put that link to that video down below in the description box as as well um, but yeah a mascara just to you know touch up your eyelashes um, next moving on to lip products so you need a lip balm because you know your lips get dry and feel chapped and you just want to keep your lips super moist and hydrated through the whole entire day my favorites are these EOS lip balms they're not super you know um, like I guess hydrating or whatever as other ones um, but I do say more or some of them are more moisturizing than others 
this one is from the Disney collection. I don't know what it what name of it is, like the scents, because it doesn't say. Um, but I've been using this one a lot. This one, I feel, is a lot more moisturizing than, like, other ones. I was just going to apply it on, and I realized I had lipstick on. Um, but this one's really, really moisturizing. Um, they kind of have, like, a wax feel, but I really i am a huge fan of these EOS lip balms. Um, so, yeah, you just need a really good lip balm just to keep your lips really moisturized and, like, soft the whole entire day. And I'm a lip balm person. I always have to have something on my lips. Um, that's just me um, then others are if you want like a little bit of color to your lip and you know you don't really want to wear like lipstick or lip gloss at school um, baby lips are the way to go these are just like little light like baby pink colors um, this is the pink wink one I believe I don't yeah this is pink wink and it's just like a nice baby pink color I'll swatch it for you guys and these um, are really, really moisturizing. They glide on really nicely to your lips. They're not super pigmented. They're just like a tinted lip balm, basically, and they just kind of give you like a sheer wash of color. And that's what it looks like. And it's just a very light pink, but it's really pretty. Plus, it adds a little bit of color and it moisturizes your lips. So it's perfect. And this one is in Twinkle. And this is more of like a light color. I don't even know how to explain this color. It's more of like a lip balm, basically, because all that's coming up is clear. So it's more of like a lip balm, just gives you a really nice, like, um, you know, sheer coverage. And it moisturizes your lips, add a little bit of shine to your lips. So these I really, really like. And those are basically all the makeup products. Um, when I was in, like, high school, I honestly didn't wear makeup until actually probably my senior year and I just wore a foundation and I didn't really keep like makeup in my bag uh, but then when I went to college my freshman year I would keep you know powder concealer pretty much all the stuff that I'm showing you guys I basically like took this um, when I was in college because I would go to like you know my boyfriend's house at the time or whatever and just want to touch up my makeup and stuff um, but in high school I barely wore makeup only my senior year probably like the last couple months of school I just wore foundation that's basically it I didn't wear makeup until I was like 19 or something um, but yeah, those are like the must-have products that um, just get me through the day and my touch-ups and all that. So now moving on to products that you guys can keep in your locker or you can just throw in your bag. Um, so the first thing are just like a body mist. These are two of my favorites. The Victoria's Secrets Pinks. The pink with a splash um, body sprays are really, really good. This one is in Sweet and Flirty. Smells really, really good, especially, you know, if you have gym you, and you're sweaty and stuff. You want to smell good. You don't want to smell like sweat and all. So just spray, you know, your favorite body spray on you and you smell good as new. Um, this is one of my favorites. I really like it. And then this is from Bath & Body Works. It's pink chiffon. This also smells really good, very floral. And, yeah, definitely need, like, a really nice body spray. Um, also, these are really good if you don't really want a body spray, you want something a little bit more stronger. Um, roll-ons are nice. This is the Ralph Lauren, like the number four one. These are nice, and you can just, you know, put these, like, roll it on, and then just, you know, go here, and then on your neck, and stuff like that. These, basically, you can't, like, spray all over, you know, like the body sprays. Um, but these are nice if you want a little bit more of a stronger scent. And then next, of course, is lotion. This is the Bath & Body Works Fresh Picked Hand Cream in Strawberries. This smells exactly like strawberries. Smells so good. They're so moisturizing. I have really dry skin, and my hands get really dry. Um, so I always have to keep, you know, um, uh, what's it called? Hand cream or whatever, or just lotion in my purse in general. Just, you know, moisturize my hands. And, yeah, this is, smells so, so good. So um, hand cream is a must, or just lotion. Another thing is a must is sanitizer. You know, you're touching everything, germs and all that. So sanitizer is a must, especially you should probably keep one in your bag and then also in your locker. Um, this is just the Bath & Body Works Paradise Coconut one. It smells really good, exactly like, pretty much like Paradise, very tropical and yeah. So hand sanitizer. Also, um, the last like, I guess, feminine product I guess is deodorant. Deodorant is a must. Um, this is the Dove Go Fresh Revive Pomegranate and Lemon Verbenia scent. I don't think I pronounced it right but you just need a deodorant you know especially when you get out of gym just to you know touch up and yeah you don't want to go smelling you know bad and like stinky and like sweaty and all that through the whole entire day of school so yeah. And you can just get like a little mini one. They sell them at Target as well. You don't have to be bring like this big old one. Um, but yeah, deodorant is a must. Last things, I keep these like in my bag. And they are um, just Tic Tacs or um, icebreakers. 
these are nice. I know some schools don't allow gum. So these are good just to pop in your mouth. These are the Tic Tac strawberry filled ones. And then these are the Icebreaker Duo Fruit Plus Cool Strawberry. I must have like a thing for strawberry. But these taste really, really good. And they're just kind of addicting. Um, but yeah. So that is basically my back to school beauty essentials. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want any other like back to school related videos, let me know in the comments down below. Um, follow me on Twitter, Keek, Vine, Instagram, all of that good stuff. And yeah, other than that, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.